classic car driving, all American muscle pro wrestler Amber Nova, and I'm here hanging out with DJ Dells. So DJ Dells, you know I love you. So let me ask you some fun questions. I'm sure you get a lot of wrestling questions all the time. Let's not talk wrestling. Right. If you could only listen to one group as far as the music for the rest of your life, who would it be? Oh, man. Only one for the rest of your life. Um, Bush. Bush. It would be Bush. What's your favorite Bush song? Machine Head. It's my entrance song. Okay, there and you I go. And I grew up on classic rock. My ringtone is Kansas, Carry On My Wayward Son, uh, ACDC. Oh man, I love ACDC. It would be a ACDC or Bush. Top three ACDC songs. Let's go. Uh, no, I really put you on the hot hell, seat. Hell's Bells. I agree with that. Um, I can't pick just three. Would Shook Me All Night Long be on there, or no? It's too commercial. Too commercial. You know when it's over? Like, Highway to Hell, that wouldn't be on there. Uh, Hell's Bells, Back in Black. Back in Black was great. Even the music video was kind of cool. Back in Black, like. Hell's Bells, and what other one would be my favorite? <laughs> Dirty Deeds. There we go. <laughs> Make sure to follow her on all of her social right media. There, Amber Nova 73. That's what's up. Hit the thumbs up button if you enjoyed this video. We'll catch you real soon. Hey, everybody. This is Charlie from Anthrax, and today I'm hanging out with the one and only DJ Dells. And you went on tour with Ozzy. That was around State of Euphoria, correct? Was that around that yeah, time? Yeah, that was around 88, around mm -hmm. that time, 88, 89. Uh, and that was our first real, like, arena tour. Um, and that was exciting, man, you know? what was what, What's it like touring with someone like Ozzy Osbourne? You know, Ozzy, to me, is like uh, uh, an idol. He's a hero, a hero of mine, because growing up with Black Sabbath um, and then Ozzy leaving Black Sabbath to do his solo thing, those first two Ozzy albums, man, can't touch those albums. They're just a, a, a part of you know heavy metal history. Yeah. So being on tour with him and watching him, and then there was this one day, we had a day off in Buffalo, New York, and I was walking down from the hotel, going into the restaurant, and Ozzy was coming out of the restaurant, and we were in Buffalo. And he stops me and he's like, man, have you tried the wings? And I, I just looked at him and I was just like, oh my God, you know, Ozzy's asking me if I tried the wings in Buffalo, New York, in Buffalo, you know? New York, Buffalo wings. And it was just like a surreal moment and I never forgot that. <laughs> just he stops me and he's like, man, have you tried the wings? <laughs> did you try the wings or not? <laughs> of course. Of course I did. Yeah. Of course I did. Ozzy told me to. Yeah. I mean, how could you not, right? <laughs> yeah. So, But yeah, it's a trip, man. It's a trip to see people like in person. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. And like your brain just goes through this whole thing like, Oh, wow, he's standing right in front of me in the flesh, you know what I mean? So, yeah, it's a trip. That's awesome, man. Hope you guys enjoyed this portion of this interview with Charlie B from Anthrax. Make sure to watch the entire interview. I will have boxes popping up. Thank you so much for watching. Everyone have a great day. Subscribe if you're new. Hit the thumbs up button and we out.